Dr. Al Victor Yakono, and I'm curating the dramaturgy for On Reefs and Eroded Lands with us. The work of the dramaturg is basically that of supporting the development uh, of a work uh, and supporting obviously the maker in, in, in getting their concepts uh, and all the way to, to fruition and, to, to, and all the way to the appreciation of the spectator and, and basically that's, that's what our work has been about. So I can see that there's an, an, an interesting relationship between, between Paolo and the dancers because uh, the, there are clearly images that Paolo is developing from his own work and research uh, and the messages he wants to convey. But there is also the input of the dancers and the input of the dancers will also, also take the work in, in, in a particular direction as well. For me, it was really interesting to see how these things came together and conceptually, and then it was very easy for me to relate and, and to give certain very precise um, suggestions. The, the work of the dramaturg has to really respect the work of the maker and the work itself. So my suggestions would always be given to Paolo about what I was seeing, in terms of imagery, in terms of how the technique uh, was um, serving that imagery or not. I also have to wear the shoes of, of the spectator who's coming to see the work for the first time and to see whether those concepts, those ideas are actually coming across. This was the kind of relationship I have with the company uh, where obviously I would see, for example, a run, I would give my feedback and of in the following run that I would see, I would see that my feedback has had an effect, yeah, or the, something has changed, there's something new to, to, uh, to relate to. It's been a really, really beautiful uh, process from, from, from that point of view um, because Paolo and the company truly appreciate the input from all the different collaborators and there's the work of, literally the work of everybody um, in, in this piece.